Hi guys! How are you guys are doing great and I'm so sorry I'm not been vlogging a lot or talking in front of you for a while now I think like a lot of some of you I think are really looking at me and really listening to me so I'm just going to get start with uh, things I want to talk today okay um right uh, as you can see I've got my hair cut it's not supposed to be of this length it's supposed to be longer and it was a it was pretty hot mistake I had to kind of like recut my hair to get a proper like you know proper looking bob so yeah kind of loving it i think it will grow on to me so probably when it's grown out longer i'll do something else with it but in the meantime i really i am living it because it's my natural hair and color is my own hair so yeah it will be my home <laughs> it will be my hate home for a while so yeah uh okay what to share okay today i want to share a few haul uh, a few items that i got for haul um actually those are these are for different or i mean separate occasions that i go so like uh today and also like last few weeks ago okay first thing i would like to share is about foundation uh i've been having quite difficulty in getting my face uh looking matted i think um everyone has that kind of problem with uh application i mean face application but uh mine was quite serious because i don't know what's the problem or whether i'm using a nice product or whether my skin is like that always so i went to sephora to get it fixed kind of so i, I it wasn't my first time i was i'm always looking out for a nice drugstore brand it was kind of hard it was either uh it was a dilemma within like either uh um what's that brand maybelline no sorry l'oreal match or bourgeois something so that's uh like the drugstore brand so i was contemplating i don't have anyone to really help me with it so i went to sephora to really kind of like you know sneak peek looking at their foundation so the higher end foundations i wasn't really really um it's so expensive it could go about 65 dollars sgd 70 something sgd like stilas and stuff like that it's i can't afford that kind of yeah so uh the nice lady at sephora was like you know trying to help me i was like okay should i you know get her to help me so i was looking at i um, mean sephora um house brand itself so she uh she asked if she, if i needed help in shades so i say like you know what you know just go ahead and knock yourself out so just she picked like three colors for me and i got the nice um nice ta -ta -ta. it's the color 35 matte pen and i am i really love this because it's supposed to mattify and it's the coverage why the sorry the coverage wise it's uh kind of medium for me i don't really go much for the much uh i don't really use lots of foundation i mean it's just like a pea size perhaps so i'm okay i'm, I'm really i'm really happy for this purchase because with this i corrected my face color as well so i got myself a uh powder the powder magnifying compact foundation oh, the whole thing is just about magnifying guys because like my face was crazy crazy oil ooze moments every time when i take my picture so and my nc45 was not the right shade for me so i may as well just invest in another foundation altogether and I got it on uh, I got it from Sephora it's color matte 34 I got one sheet uh, lighter so it's supposed to be it's supposed to be that way you know to once it's oxidized and you know my skin is all you know set it so I think it will probably go to my natural face color I like really, I really like it I've been wearing it for like about I think two weeks already it is really really nice I think um, I will still I will still look for other uh, foundation if I'm you know like if I got some nice recommendations but for the meantime I think this house brand is really not bad and it's kind of the price I will really pay you know so yeah and because like this month is my birthday month I was um, I was given the chance to redeem my birthday gift so I've got myself a little Sephora Thing. I don't know what you call it, like a square thing with a mirror. They have a mirror here and the quartz of uh, four uh, eyeshadow 
palette as well as two lip glosses and a blusher i have the blusher today i'm quite happy with it you don't really have to have like a specific you know like the need to have a specific specific uh, face color to have the eyeshadow but so it's great i've not really touched on the lip glosses though it looks like it's a bit like you know touch i kind of like dip dip my fingers on it so i'm not really i'm not really loving that but the four eyeshadow is really they're really really great i really love those colors really really great i wish actually had in fact i really had this for my christmas party and i'm wearing the black and the green color today so I really love it. It's really really nice. Uh, quite pigmented and uh, it's a convenient. So that and um, to share some drugstore items. I have went to a few days ago I was like kind of wanted to fix my eyebrow um, to get a proper eyebrow applicator. So the ones that I had uh, the ones I got from bank, uh, sorry, the ones I got from Jakarta is already used up, and I was distraught. Uh, I couldn't decide on brand wise. You know, I've been always, you know, looking at like the videos from the YouTubers. So, but I decided like to follow my own gut. So I went to Silky Girl. Silky Girl is a uh, drugstore brand in Singapore. So I got myself a high definition brow liner. It's so sm what's so smart about this is that, and I got it from uh, I got it in a dark brown color. Uh, what's so smart about this is that it's retractable and it's so convenient and easy to use that I feel like you know it should be you know it sh every every eye eyebrow should eyebrow and it should be like this and it's so tiny you can really control your you know where you want to draw and how you want to blend uh, the brushes at the end it's so smart I feel like this is kind of my go-to brow brow applicator so I'm loving it for now and uh, it's really good I really like it and I've been having a bit problem with uh, applying my eyeshadow because it just doesn't just doesn't stay I don't know if I really have to apply proper primer but um, I would try to go like you know basics or you know high end so I want to try for something basics first so and today I actually have it on like if you can see because I'm using this uh white underneath all the all of that. So white and then the black for my eye shadow uh sorry not eye uh black for the eyeliner part. But of course I have my liquid eyeliner before I have this on you know to kind of fill up the gaps. It's really great. I really love it. And it's so smart yet again, like you know, having two sides of the both ends of the you know <laughs> how to say the best of the both worlds so yeah um and uh, today i got myself a new uh my my phone my handphone is a uh, note 2 samsung note 2 and i got myself a glow eye glow uh case it's really cute i really like it because i've always i'm always um I'm always watching something on my phone so I got something that I can really open it open up and just you know put it on the um, table or anywhere it's easy for me to watch video so it's really cute and I really love it and it's kind of complimenting my camera I didn't realize that it's in like hot pink so yeah um, uh, yeah and also for um, I'm trying to look for uh colors inspiring colors for my nail color i mean to add more colors so it's really really hard guys i don't know what color is so it works i mean like that would really really work for me i've only liking i'm only been liking like gray or uh, um gray really really a dark red or um maybe like a nude nude pink but I'm really trying to look for more better colors that were really, you know. So I got myself today. I went to some beauty shop, like a kind of a drugstore, drugstore as well. So I got myself a Mystic Bronze. The title is Mystic Bronze. It's from OT. I think it's from Korea or something. And uh, the color is like such. Is it possible? Is it able to see? I really love it because. Um, it's small. I don't really have to, you know, I don't really have much pressure to use up everything before it dries out and I like the color that it's kind of like shimmery or shiny yet um, it's not so obvious 
it's kind of like mellow down so I like it so I'll, I'll, I'll try to apply it tomorrow and see how it looks yeah and um, the last but not the least pair of nice shoes I think of all many things I've never never showed anyone what kind of shoes I wore or am wearing so yeah probably you'll come where <laughs> come slowly and uh, today I was at Mundo it's a uh, it's a shoe shop in Singapore uh, it's kind of like not really expensive at all and but yet the brand uh, the, the, uh, the quality is kind of not bad I really love the quality because you don't really have to wear the shoe like all the time you know it's like you can have that pair of shoe for like maybe two months because anyway trendy right you kind of like change your taste pretty quickly so yep so I got myself a nice looking wedge. The color is not really very clear, guys. It's really like a dark uh, brown kind of purple, brown purple. So or kind it's shiny, and I like that it's kind. It's a bit girlish for me. I'm kind of shocked that I would like this kind of things. But anyway, uh, right. I still I still want to try give it a shot like maybe tomorrow or a couple of days later on for something for Christmassy it's very Christmassy I didn't realize that but anyway I had this like 20% off it's about 40 SGD really really great buy for me so I guess that is all for my haul so I will catch you guys later and I will share with you other things as well so thank you for watching and uh, do like my videos subscribe to me and uh, watch out for my um updates all right thanks guys ciao